and this is part two of the Elseworlds crossover. I am very, very, very excited for this episode because the last one was definitely better than I expected, and I love the ending with the Batwoman cameo. <sighs> But now, this episode, we're legitimately getting her. This is like her official debut. We're going to see her in action, and we're getting Arkham Asylum. I'm especially excited for that. I'm definitely excited to see if they tease or reference other Batman villains. And I'm wondering if we're getting Nora Freeze tonight. Either tonight or tomorrow. I'm not sure. But overall, I'm just really, really fucking excited. Wait, Holy shit! That's Slade's son! He's back? <clears throat> or is this an alternate version of him? Oh, I'm pretty sure this is him. Boy, you're trying to be Deathstroke 2.0. You'll never be as good. Oh, please don't you dare hurt Diggle. Oh, come on, Diggle. Fuck this bitch up. Uh-uh. Oh, it's always that. Oh, Barry! I mean, Oliver, or both! <laughs> yeah, we do. Oh, I love the logo. I love how it matches with the, the show. <gasps> the bat signal. Yeah, somebody's in there! You still think he's in there? Yeah! Let's go! Just do me a favor and turn it on. Turn it on! Ugh. She's watching them, isn't she? Batwoman's fucking watching them. Oh my god! Don't go to commercial, don't go to commercial! Fuck you! Do it! <laughs> Bitch! Fuck him up! GCPD! It's weird that I'm excited for that. Can we just knock him out? Please? They're gonna lock him up in the GCPD, aren't they? Well, that is definitely not Chris Wayne. Oh, duh! Oliver Queen. Holy shit! Yeah, yeah, I'm Oliver Queen. Kate Kane! Yeah. Then you are? The rain on your parade. If you're visiting Gotham to compare grappling hooks with Batman, you are out of luck. No one's seen him in years. Gotcha. Oh, I thought she was going to do yeah. superhero landing. I would never compare myself to a total badass like Batman. Uh, what I think Oliver is trying to say is thank you for getting us out of jail. What Oliver is actually trying to say is, who are you? And Name's Kate Kane. Gotham has enough problems without a guy in green leather showing off his arrows to everyone. So, the faster you find what you're looking for, the faster you can get the hell out of my city. Uh, but Dang. what, what should we call you? Rain? Miss Batwoman. Raid? Kane. Kate Kane. I would, actually. He's a doctor at Arkham Asylum. I have to go tell the boys. Uh, hey, thanks. For the help. Arkham Asylum. Next stop. I like her already. Oh, she going to suit up. She got her own little bat cave, didn't she? Oh my god. 
I'm so hyped for this. Oh, duh. No, I thought it was cool. Oh my god. So we're sure he works here. Well, it's probably too late for him to still be at work, but if we find his office... This is Arkham Asylum in Gotham City. It's never too fucking late. Yeah. You got a few of those in here like that. Fill this out. Hey. Are you referring to... Mr. Freeze? I really hope Mr. Freeze is in this. What was this? We're having a dance routine? I took some square dancing in my middle school. It was shit. It was stupid, but... Oh. Fuck. Oh, he released the prisoners. Oh my god, Nora Freeze! My crow saves you shut off. Wanna lock in? Is that Bane's mask? He's the oh my god, it's he's Nora Freeze! Said, Is your husband here work. too? Okay, maybe you should just take a step back. Get away from me! You cold bitch. Oh! their asses. Batarangs! Oh my god. I love it. I fucking love it. Me Batwoman. Oh shit. That's... Oh she's not Mrs. Freeze. That's Victor Freeze's gun. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. She got Mr. Freeze's gun! So is he here though, in Arkham? On the loose? What are you- Oh, is he getting the book? Yep. Okay, it's a book, not a cup of tea with sugar. Oh shit. Toxin? Holy shit! Holy shit! What? Oh my god. Batwoman. It's fear toxin, isn't it? No, seriously. Mm hmm They already know. I don't do tearful goodbyes. No, I, I, I just tell them to wish you luck. Wherever your cousin is, I'm sure he's really proud of you. Thanks for vision. You really do have a lot of tattoos. And somehow I feel like car dancers doesn't have a single one. You know, it's such a shame I have to go. I feel like we would make a good team. Yeah. World finest. She'll be the third part, right? <laughs> I want to see her again. You will always be the love of my life. Feel the change. In the city. What the? He said you were testing us. And thus far, I am unimpressed. A crisis Did is. Did he kill him? Someone or transport him? Someone far, far more powerful than myself. I knew it. I mean to prepare. I 
giving a bar and all I knew it. He's just a red herring. He's working for someone. The universe is to find one. I hope strong enough to stand against them. You're causing chaos. And you're blaming everyone else. In the hope of finding the champions that would... So he's a master and he wants to overthrow him. You are the first of those I've placed under fire who have managed to retrieve the Book of Destiny. No. For all the good it did you. This is Kara. Yeah, I'd love to. Beat the shit out of this guy. You show potential. Let us see if it's anything more. Don't suck. It's gonna be... There's no place you can run where I can't find you. Holy shit! It's over. Okay, maybe he's not evil, but I don't know. Don't end it right here. No! I need the last part now! I hate waiting. In all new episodes, that was good though. Legends of Tomorrow is coming up next on the CW. This is no longer your world. It's mine. Oh yeah, he's evil. Are you truly that eager to die? I am the hero of this earth. Maybe it's a monster. No. I'm Superman. It reminds me of the Superman from Injustice. The delusional, insane kind. Holy shit, that was amazing. I think I definitely like this part better than yesterday's. I mean, yesterday's was good, but this one was just... I think it's because it was more action-packed. But, oh my god, I loved Gotham. I loved Arkham Asylum. And I loved Batwoman, Kate Kane. I actually really, really loved Ruby Rose. Because... When they announced it, like, in... I forgot when they announced that she'd be playing Batwoman. I think it was a few months ago during the summer, I think. A lot of people started hating on her because they don't like her acting. I, personally, have never really seen her in many stuff. Like, she was in the Meg, but she was it wasn't really that big of a role or something. But, like, she was fine in the Meg to me. Like, I swore that I wouldn't judge her until the crossover came. Because I know a lot of people were hating on her all before this even came out. But... Now that I've seen her, I actually really like her as Batwoman. Like, I just, she was amazing. <sighs> and I, even though she didn't, we didn't have much action with her, I loved when Barry and Oliver were hallucinating and she, like, did a flip and pinned them both down. That was amazing. I feel like she's not going to be in the third part of the crossover, which I can kind of understand because she's going to stay in Gotham and everything. But I want more. But that's okay. We're most likely definitely getting the show next year, which is good, but that makes me wonder. If we're getting Batwoman next year and it's officially part of the Arrowverse, that makes me wonder if one of the shows in the Arrowverse currently right now is going to get cancelled. That way they can fit it into their schedule with CW. Arrow is not going anywhere, Flash is definitely not going anywhere, Supergirl not going anywhere, Legends I can see getting cancelled, only because, at least for me, it's always been the weakest. I can just see it getting cancelled for Batwoman. And Black Lightning, even though I'm not really sure it's officially labeled as part of the Arrowverse, I'm still on season one, so I don't know. I, I can't speak for Black Lightning because I'm still catching up. It's been slow so far, but it's been pretty good. Um, but yeah, I definitely think we're going to get the show next year. It's currently in development, but I don't think it's officially been picked up and greenlit for a pilot. But I think they were waiting until after the crossover, that way they could see how she did. I think she did amazing. Granted, she wasn't in it that much, but she was she was good. I really loved her. And I was right when I thought that the Monitor wasn't the true villain. He's working for someone and obviously I'm I'm not 100% sure it's evil Superman. Is that who he's working for? I'm not 100% sure. I think I am. I mean, I think it's him. I, at first I didn't think he was evil. I thought it was just a different outfit. But no, he's evil. The promo definitely proved that. And the way he talked and acted, it reminds me of... um. The, I don't know if you guys have ever played the game Injustice, but it's where he's he's good at first, but then the Joker tricks him into killing Lois Lane, then he goes insane, kills the Joker, becomes evil. This isn't the same thing, but like, he gave me Injustice vibes, because he's, it looks like he's a bit of a dictator in there. He's a ruler, he called it my, my world, not my world as in my home, my world as in my place to rule. So he gave me, he definitely gave me Injustice vibes with that, so that'll be interesting. <sighs> It's just, I knew the Monitor wasn't the real villain. I knew he was just a red herring.
I'm definitely loving this crossover more than I thought I would. Like, I was already interested in it, but I wasn't sure how it would be compared to last year's crossover. But this one's definitely good. I'm not 100% sure if I like it more than Crisis of Earth X, but it's still probably my second favorite crossover, definitely. Well, that was part two of the official Elseworlds crossover. Overall, it was a really, really good episode. Definitely way better than part one, even though part one was still really good. I loved Batwoman. I loved Ruby Rose. Oh god, I really hope the pilot gets picked up for next year in the fall. Because if they do, you can already count on me. I'll be watching it and I'll definitely be reacting to it. You can count on that. Oh my god. Well, thank you all so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Be sure to let me know what you thought of this episode and how excited you are for tomorrow night's episode, the last part of the crossover. Oh my god. And I will see you guys next time.